Hi, Super Spruce here, back with Enter and Mention, New Game Plus 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 video, episode 191, and it, you can see, again, the light empowerment from last episode. I'm going to do it, but of course, first I have to enter Big Rip, and I'm just going to try to get as many ghost particles as, as I can. It looks like I'm going to be able to get over E1000 ghost particles, which is insane. Also, how close am I to the next radioactive decay? I'm actually pretty close to the 10th to the 10th radioactive decay. I'm not quite there, but I'm close. And I'm, I don't think I'm gonna grind all the way to it, but it's definitely possible. I'm also gonna see if I can get anything in nano field. Doesn't really look like I'm gonna be able to get much more than 98 rewards again. So I'm just going to ghostify and then do the light empowerment. So um, of course, of course, first I have to, you know, grab all of these. There's only three of these I can get, and I can get E1009 ghost particles. So here we go, I'm gonna just get the neutrino molts, and then light empowerment. So hopefully this should be, I, I, this is gonna be quick. I, I, I know it's gonna be quick. I don't know why I'm like, hopefully it should be quick. Also, I, for, I forgot to dilate time, whatever. I don't think that really matters. It gives me barely anything at this point. It's, it's, all, it's usually only just a few orders of magnitude, and that's it. Um, let's see, Tree of Decay, I'm up to E137 spins. If I probably exit Big Rip, I can probably get a lot more. I'm going to say Photon stuff, and yeah, this is, this is going to be pretty, pretty fast. It may, may not actually be quite as fast as I, as I want it to be, but it's still going to be fast regardless. Okay, I'm just going to go back into Big Rip now. There's not really much I can do outside of Big Rip, so inside Big Rip, yeah, now I have like E216 spin, eight radioactive decays in each branch, nano field up to 94, probably 95 rewards, and it's, you just keep doing this a, a couple of times. I mean, I guess it could get a little tedious, but at this point, the light empowerment is like only once every few days, so it's, it's sort of like a ghost divide during the photons wall, so it's really actually not that bad. Like, I'm up to E72, Billion antimatter in Big Rip. I can probably um, get up to almost E80 billion in Big Rip in just a few more cycles. Okay, I'm gonna go back into Big Rip, see if I can get anything. I can get up to E78 billion in Big Rip, so that's. I'm now up to 9 radioactive decays in each branch. I'm not. I don't think I'm gonna try to push to 10 at this point, but maybe later on I can. And I'm, I think I will try to get 98 rewards. Just like before, so I, I match where I was before, but it's just gonna it's just gonna take a while. I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna grind a little bit in Bolsonic Lab, like outside of Big Rip, and then I'll actually do like a day inside of Big Rip to see how far I can get. I can hopefully get the tenth radioactive decay, and perhaps the um, 104, 104 rewards to get the anti prion ghost to come out. Of hiding, so yeah, there's not much I can do here. So like, e like even with photons, like I'm, I'm getting 200 trillion per second. It's gonna easily be enough to um, give me enough ghostly rays to reach the next light empowerment. It's really just gonna be the the dark matter that will be limiting things. So yeah, there's really not much else I can do. So yeah, see you in a bit. Okay, I'm back a day later, and I have E141 quadrillion ice matter. And I can actually, I noticed, yeah, I can get a lot of neutrinos. So if I neutrino grind, that will give me, yeah, about almost 70 orders of magnitude of neutrinos, or at least over 65 orders of magnitude, which is pretty good. And in Bosonic Lab, um, I'm now up to 171 quintillion Z bosons. It's really not all that much. So actually, it looks like I've almost exactly exhausted my, um, anti prions I could have used the bosonic overdrive but I don't, I don't know I I I think I'm just gonna I'm gonna do this and like with the bosonic overdrive at maybe something like 2.4 times and then I just keep doing it like this and this should um, give okay it's not really gonna give all that much more but whatever it'll do something I should probably also now Start focusing on quantum bosonic runes instead of infinity bosonic runes, and um, and for the use and chance again, just use this instead, and that will allow me to 
get a little bit more progress. It's not really going to be all that much progress. I am up to 1.2 quintillion ghostly rays, which makes me think I want to um, go into Big Rip. So, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll just go into Big Rip here and e 84 billion in Big Rip. That's, that's really good because that means, let's see, E260 spin. That, I, I've never had this much spin and it's pretty close to the next radioactive decay. Also, Nanofield, 97, 98. Doesn't look like I'm really going to get 104 rewards. I could get 99, which is cool, but uh, yeah, I, I still, I, I'm going to need like E265 spins to be able to get the next radioactive decay, which is an annoying, but whatever. I, I'll, I'll deal with it. Also, um, yeah, two orders of magnitude of attack and particles. I thought it was going to be more than that, but whatever. Two is still fine. Like, a anything counts at this point. Okay, I've gotten, um, I've not gotten the next ray after the K, but I've gotten another level of the tachyon particle for gain formula is increased, which means I can get six orders of magnitude of tachyon particles. So, yeah, that's, that's pretty cool, but it's not all that useful. I'm up to 99 rewards. I, I have been doing a little bit of Bosonic Lab stuff, but it's really not all, I can't really do all that much. But I'm really close to the next radioactive decay. All I need is just one more of these middle upgrades, which is 6E264. And I'm at 2E264, at least with some of the branches. So, yeah, I'm, I'm almost there. So, yeah, see in a bit. And it looks like the blue branch is going to make it first. And, yeah, that, once I get all the branches, boom, E275 spins which is yeah, pretty powerful. It's not enough to get another one of the levels of these, but it's still just going to be overall powerful. And honestly, okay, the, that's not a lot of tachyon particles. Maybe with all of that, like, and maybe better photons stuff, maybe I can get more than 99 rewards if I just exit and re-enter Big Rip. Remember, I also get um, the best space shards outside of Big Rip now. So maybe if I just try to push the antimatter as far as I can, I think... I had E145.999 quadrillion antimatter, so like with this, I'm not quite there, but I will be getting space shards and quarks, so like that will be giving me um, like like more orders of magnitude of neutrinos. Like you can see, uh, you gotta click the right buttons first. Uh, it's not all that much, but it's something. Like like I'm I'm still gonna do it. It's five orders of magnitude of neutrinos. Whatever, every little bit counts. That's really, it's really what it is at this point because it's very slow, and maybe I can get better nano field because the thing is with nano fields is that um, I can only push it for like a couple minutes and then the anti energy hits the cap. So yeah, it doesn't look, really look like there's much I can do here. I mean, I guess I can push quark spins, just a few orders of magnitude, but that's about it. Like. With Bosonic, even with Bosonic Lab, there's not a lot of stuff I can do. Like, I think at this point, I'm just going to be gaining antiprions and setting the overdrive speed to just one. And then just trying to get as many um, quantum Bosonic runes as possible so I can try to level this up as much as possible. So, yeah, it's unfortunately, it's, it's, very, it's very boring, but I guess that's what this game is at some or yeah at some point I, i'm i think i'm just gonna do it outside of big rip so i can push the dark matter that'll allow me to get more of all the light boosts so yeah seen a bit okay i'm back a couple days later and um well first i have 160 quadrillion bosonic antimatter which is enough to get this upgrade except i don't have the runes for it so yeah also i'm up to 580 trillion w plus bosons it isn't really all that much but i guess it's something and I, I, yeah, I think I think what I'm do I'm gonna do. Um, honestly, I'm just gonna gain anti prions at this point, just so I can get you know like because I, I don't really want to decay W quark because that will um, make the rune extraction slower. Um, I guess I could oscillate Z neutrino, but it would do barely anything, and, and then this also would do nothing, and it makes me I'll lose anti prions. So yeah, I'm, I'm gonna avoid I'm gonna avoid those. So what I need for this upgrade here, I need 75 million Eternity Bosonic Runes and 15 million um, Quantum Bosonic Runes. The thing is that I I can also get this, which will 
Uh, I don't think it's going to help me get runes faster, but it'll at least speed up the production and use of anti-prions. Or it could just try this, because I, f I feel like I'm, I'm, okay, if I s extract it like this, I can gain, um, 574,000, it's actually 2 million per second, so that's not even a problem. I guess I'm just going to spend it into this because it will not use up all the quantum sonic runes, so, yeah, here we go. It's not even going to do all that much, but it's, it's something, and yeah, now I just need to wait for, um, 75 million eternity balsonic runes so I can get the final balsonic upgrade, and I think that's going to be next episode. But, yeah, before next episode, I still will do a couple of things, like go into Big Rip, just to see how far I can get. E87 billion antimatter in Big Rip, E turn 80 spins, and let's see, let's see Nano Field. Can I get 100 rewards? Doesn't really look like it, but at least I, I'll i try, at least I give it a shot. And maybe I can also gain some more tachyon particles, okay, a tiny bit more, but... That, that's about it. So I think what I'm just going to do next episode, I will get the final Bosonic upgrade. And yeah, this is like the final thing I can do in New Game Plus Plus Plus. I mean, it's not the final thing I can do, but it's, you know, the final upgrade in all of New Game Plus 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 right now. So yeah, this is, this is a big moment in a series. It's almost 200 episodes. I am getting close to its finish. So yeah, hope you enjoyed. Peace out.